if you know your history then you will know where you are coming from and in whatever you do seek wisdom knowledge is power inugo makadi book hip-hop and Igbo culture authored by martin ifan ichuku akz as our number the first metal of ebon at the 103.5 fm there is a great insight in hip-hop and Igbo culture you can get this book or pick it up at a bookshop in st Teresa's Catholic church Omonya. or at ebon at the 103.5 fm ogidi but you go to www.amazon.com search for hip-hop and Igbo culture by martin ifan ichuku akz for further information on how to get this book please call 080-3916-7049 or you whatsapp 080-65-79-6599 over 30 years blind and deaf students have benefited a lot from the life of philanthropy of the ceo of juu okk transport company sir godwin obaka okk and lady patricia obiageri okk who celebrated their 75th and 70th birthdays respectively on sunday 30th june 2024 at cj patterson hall all saints cathedral amidst friends well wishers family and the less privileged who came out a mass to celebrate their benefactors who also dedicated and handed over school building and hostel for deaf students to bishop owen Mokolo, bishop on the niger anglican communion the colorful event where the osinashi corona humble smith performed to celebrate the kind-hearted couple was witnessed by people from different walks of life much elated guests uche obi who have witnessed the benevolence of chief godwin and patricia okk to the society most especially the less privileged for years prayed for long life and prosperity on the family i'm, I'm very elated at uh, this opportunity i um we're here to celebrate their benevolence to um the society which is something they've done over the years but today was the dedication of uh, the classroom and um, um, hostel built at uh, for the special school for the disabled students in somewhere or that or central school or that. Way. So um, that also gave us the opportunity to celebrate and thank God for His faithfulness in their life, in their lives over the years, and it created a rare opportunity to for us to call people to come and celebrate them, knowing that uh, they have been they are very unassuming people. In fact, like when people um, get to hear their story, they marvel like, okay, is this the guy I've been hearing about? Is this the woman? So, I mean, this is a real opportunity for us to celebrate them and then we we'll give all glory and honor to God for keeping them, for blessing them with the resources which he has given them to continue to intervene in the life of the less privileged for over four decades now. The principal of the special secondary school for the deaf, Mrs. Ifoma Felicia Ago, appreciated God for using Chief Sir Godwin Obaka, OKK, and Lady Patricia Obiageri OKK to elevate the deaf students. She also promised to use love as tool to improve their learning. Uh, no need of saying it everybody has seen it and him or herself. God has done it for us with our own happiness. And the happiness can not stop. Because what not even know it will happen in my own time as a principal there happened to be. Which has been written. Show them love. Okay. If you show them love, they will do their best. A very excited and happy Ugoshi Okeke gave thanks to God for the opportunity to celebrate his appearance and his family and well wishers while pointing at the school building for deaf students as a legacy of his father that they, as the children, hope to continue. I feel very happy, uh, excited, and uh, thankful to God. So uh, today for us is really a day of joy, happiness, and appreciation, and thanksgiving to God, which is the hallmark of what we are doing today. This is a family project for us, so it doesn't end here. It is something that continues. And, uh, so for me, like I said earlier, it's something that's been passed down from my parents to us and it is something that we hope to pass on to our children as well. So for us, this is a continuing legacy for the family. Looking at the fact that awareness needs to be created on behalf of the disabled in the society today, 
Dr. Chukwemeka Okeke stated that the end product of the school building for deaf students is to see the deaf students progress in academics as well as acquire skills that will help them succeed in life. He also pointed out that life is not about cars, washes, or jewelries, but about living a life above oneself, as he called on everyone that must have benefited from the life of philanthropy of Sir Godwin Obaka Okeke and Lady Patricia Okeke to pay it forward by helping other people. You know, so a life that has touched business, family, community service, social activism, speaking up for those who do not have the voice, standing up for those who cannot stand, right? I don't have any more message for them because they have it all figured out. They understand this life better than most people. It's not about how many cars, it's not about how many clothes, it's not about the type of what you wear. It's living a life beyond self. So the only people I have a message for, if you know you have benefited from Sir Godwin Obaka and Lady Patricia of the Ageli Okeke, please, please pay it forward that it shall be well with you. What they are is light bearers. If they're giving you a little bit of that light and you hold it onto yourself, it may not work out so well for you. From C.J. Patterson Hall, All Saints Cathedral on Asia, venue of the 75th and 70th birthday celebration of Sir and Lady Godwin Obaka and Patricia Okeke, Martin Ifan Shuku Ekeze reporting. <laughs> If you know your history, then you will know where you are coming from. And in whatever you do, seek wisdom. Knowledge is power. Inugo Makadi book, Hip Hop and Igbo Culture, authored by Martin Ifani Chuku AKZ as our number the first. Metal of Ebon at the 103.5 FM. There is a great insight in hip hop and Igbo culture. You can get this book or pick it up at a bookshop in St. Teresa's Catholic Church Omonya. or at Ebon at the 103.5 FM Ogidi. But you go to www.amazon.com search for hip hop and Igbo culture by Martin Ifani Chuku AKZ for further information on how to get this book please call 080-3916-7049 or you whatsapp 080-65-79-6599 <laughs>